It was money meant to help mid-state students pay for college, but instead it ended up in the pockets of a now former TSU admissions office employee. News Channel 5's Jason Lamb tells us that man is now under arrest and facing federal charges for setting up the scheme. Prosecutors say that scheme bilked students out of more than $84,000, much of that money ending up in the suspect's bank account. The 12 count indictment released Tuesday charges this man, 31 year old Renald Clayton, with carrying out the plot. He lives in Chicago now, but the indictment says when he worked in the admissions office of TSU back in 2014 and 2015, he got access to personal info of TSU students receiving federal student aid payments and changed the bank account numbers for those payments to his own bank account. The indictment says TSU's own auditors first started looking into the problem after students complained of not getting their payments. The feds got involved, who say Clayton took more than $80,000 from TSU students, with more than $60,000 going into his own bank accounts. TSU says they are continuing to work with the feds, and they said today in a statement, we continue to take security measures to ensure the integrity of our systems and financial aid processes, and the employee no longer works at TSU. Clayton has a lengthy criminal history in Nashville with convictions for criminal impersonation and attempted theft. If he's convicted on these federal charges, Clayton faces up to 20 years in prison and a $250,000 fine. Jason Lamb, News Channel 5.